Okay, here comes Love Shack, our biggest hit ever. And one of the number one wedding songs of all time. <laughs> and karaoke. Oop, boing. Oh, come on. Okay, there we go. Nothing like a good drum intro. So I was driving up to Woodstock where the band was jamming and I was trying to come up with titles for songs and Love Shack just popped in my mind. I didn't know of other that other bands had done songs called Love Shack. Um, so it was all original to me. So I, I put out the, the title and um, when we started uh, uh, also jamming in New York City, uh, we each, Kate, Cindy and I doing the lyrics thought of uh, what the Love Shack meant. Uh, for me, when I was coming up with the title and some, some lyric ideas, uh, there was a club in, well, 20 miles outside of Athens in the middle of nowhere called the Hawaiian Holly. And it was an African American disco that friends of mine had discovered. And I don't know why it was called the Hawaiian Holly, because it's in like Comer, Georgia. But um, <laughs> uh, you'd open the door, and it, it's because it's like in the woods somewhere. You'd open the door, and all of a sudden you're in this fabulous African American wild disco playing wild music, James Brown, everything. And um, so uh, that's, that, that became my inspiration. I think Kate thought of um, her house. Uh, she, lived in a, she lived in a shack with uh, like one heater, no running water. She had a pump in her, uh, live, uh, in her kitchen. She had an outhouse, you know, so you have to watch out for black widows and things like that. Cows would come up and she had chickens. Um, but uh, when you see uh, the video, uh, we tried to just create a real wild party. Everyone's invited, because uh, that's always been our philosophy for shows. Uh, everyone's invited. Uh, if you're old, young, any race, creed, or color, uh, well, Donald Trump don't come. Uh, you're invited to our party. Uh, and uh, when you, uh, well, Chrysler's in America back then were as big as whales. I'm thinking of like a 1970 Chrysler. I mean, it's like a boat with wheels. Um, so somebody on the set had a Chrysler, giant Chrysler convertible. And so we performed in that. And then we had uh, Zach Alford, Sarah Lee, and Pat Irwin in the video because they were our touring band. Uh, we had friends come up. Uh, we spent two days filming. And uh, when the police saw all the wildness coming into this small town in upstate New York, they said, we don't like those kind of people. And we, you know, you know F you, who cares? Uh, so we just did our thing. Uh, you'll see RuPaul starting the, um, the uh, dance line down the thing, which we always did. We loved a dance line, you know, where everyone takes turn dancing. I was doing a dance called the Panty Flame, where you pull down your undies and throw them, you know, away. Um, and when Cindy, when we were jamming, we don't always hear what the others are saying, so I was singing uh, whatever, then Cindy said, tin roof rusted, but I didn't hear what she said, and I go, you're what? And then she goes, tin roof rusted. So we thought, hey, let's keep that in, because we're the beef twos, we're gonna do whatever we want. And actually this song, Warners didn't get it, Ra uh, uh, big name radio didn't get it, but uh, it started taking off on college and alternative radio. And when uh, the major radio stations heard it, all of a sudden we're in demand. And then we did two 18-month tours, uh, almost lost our minds. Um, 
But thank you, Love Shack. Keeps us going. And don't expect me to get on stage and do karaoke with you, even though you're massacring it. He said to me, oh man, you know, that's a B-side. And I said, no, I said, no, I honestly really do believe this could, and I, it was one of those moments where you had to kind of stand up for what you, what you really thought and believed about your work. I thought it actually sounded quite good, just hitting the one note and not, not going anywhere with it, just leaving it. Now we go somewhere with it, you know, kind of as an afterthought. And that became um, quite a feature of the song.